An example that shows that not every set is a subspace. For example, consider the set of all singular matrices. Singular matrices, the determinant of A is zero. So we say that A is singular. Very good. So is this a subspace of this uh, space of all two by two matrices? Let's show that the steps behind this solution. First of all, we need to show that W is non-empty. So you can take, for example, zero matrix, zero, 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 or any other matrices. For example, this guy here. A is equal to 1, 0, 0, 0. So the determinant of A is basically 0. So A is in W. So W is non-empty. So we're good with the first step. Now we need to show that it is closed under matrix addition. What's the meaning of that? It means that if I take two singular matrices, if we take A and B from W, singular matrices, then there's some A plus B must be in W or a plus B must be singular. Well, let us think a little bit. If I take, for example, these two matrices, one, zero, 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 and add it to another matrix, zero, 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 one, both of these matrices are singular, but their sum is one, zero, zero, one, which is not singular. So what is the meaning of this? It means that W is not closed under matrix addition. So what is our conclusion? So W is not a subspace of M2 and